हे गाय सा इज यूर बैक विथ अनदर इंटरेस्टिंग एंड मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट वीडियो एंड हियर इट इज माई फर्स्ट फोन इज रूटेड विथ मैजिस्क सेकेंड फोन इज रूटेड विथ कर्नल एस यू एंड थर्ड फोन इज रूटेड विथ ए पैच सो वॉट इज द टूडे वीडियो सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट हाउ टू फिक्स स्ट्रॉग इंटीग्रिटी और इन अदर वर्ड्स आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट हाउ टू फिक्स डिवाइस इज नॉट सर्टिफाइड ओके सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट दिस प्रॉब्लम हाउ टू फिक्स दिस प्रॉब्लम सो लेट्स स्टार्ट द प्रोसेस सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू माई डिवाइस इज सर्टिफाइड और नॉट एज वी कैन सी माई इट शोज माई डिवाइस इज सर्टिफाइड बट एक्चुअली इट इज नॉट सर्टिफाइड सो इफ आई क्लियर द डेटा ऑफ प्ले स्टोर एंड अगेन री ओपन द प्ले स्टोर देन यू कैन सी माई डिवाइस इज नॉट सर्टिफाइड लेट्स वेट आई विल शो यू सो एज वी कैन सी हेयर इट इज my device is not certified because as we previously see our basic integrity strong uh, device integrity is not fixed so how to fix it so here it is the important modules which we are going to flash as we can see play integrity fix fork okay play integrity fork module i am using play integrity fork module because the uh, official play integrity fix module developer discontinued the project okay so that's why i'm going to use play integrity fix fork module okay so download this all modules which i show you from description okay after that uh, you need to turn off one setting on your device okay so what is that setting if you are using custom rom or any port rom so if in your rom this option is present google play integrity spoof so turn off this option okay it is mandatory before going to do anything first of all you need to turn off this google integrity spoof option okay if you don't have this option you can skip it but if you have it then disable it okay and here it is i am going to do this process on my magisk Okay, if you have kernel as your A patch, the process is same. Modules is also same. Okay, so let's start the flashing process. So simply came on module section, install from module. So first module which we need to install that is regisisk. Install it again. Install second module. The second module is play integrity fork module. Okay, after flashing play integrity fork, third module is tricky store. Okay, after flashing these three modules, as we can see, simply reboot your device. So I'm going to reboot my device. Okay, the reboot is complete. Device is turned on. Now again, go open the Magisk. Go and install from storage. And the last module which we need to install that is tricky add-on. So simply flash it and click on reboot. Okay, the device is reboot successful. Now again, open the Magisk. now we need to see one important setting which is zygisk as we can see here it is in my device the zygisk is yes if in your case in your case the zygisk is shows no that means you need to turn on this zygisk option in because in some roms the zygisk is not enable if you flash regisk module even you flash regisk module but the zygisk is not going to turn on that means it's not say s so you need to do enable on magis settings okay if the module is not going to work on your rom then you need to use uh, magisk by default uh, zygisk toggle okay after enabling zygisk if zygisk is not enable then enable the toggle of this zygisk and reboot your device the zygisk is going to on that means yes now what is next step you need to click on this play integrity fork action button okay you need to click on action so click on this action button on play integrity fork and it will load some important requirements so wait some time okay after it complete click on close now click on this tricky store action button so it will open this application if it says grant the root permission then grant it okay if you are using magisk then you need to give the grant permission to this application if you are using kernel su or um, a patch then no need to give any grant permission because when you click on open so it will directly going to open and it it is automatically granted root access okay now what is next now click on this three lines on right side top then click on select all then again click on 
deselect unnecessary okay again click on this three lines then click on set valid key box then wait some seconds then again click on this three lines then click on set security patch okay now we need to click on get security patch date okay so simply click on this get security patch date so when you click on it you can see the data is fetching on bottom of the left then it says done then click on save okay after that click on again save that's it the process is done now open the play integrity checker and click on check and as we can see here it is the three checks is ticked okay basic integrity fixed device integrity fix and strong integrity also fixed so this is the method okay and open your play store okay let's check the device is certified or not so i'm going to install my password because i am not set any fingerprint or pattern to my device so it, that's why it asking password okay when you go on this play store settings and as we can see still the device is not certified even but we are past the strong integrity also then click on this fix device wait some seconds as we can see device checks complete and now device is certified okay so this is the method so as we can see our first device is successfully passed the strong integrity but what about this both remaining devices the devices is not going to pass strong integrity okay because the problem is rom problem so you need to change the rom better if you go for latest security patch custom roms okay and if you are using any stock rom like i am using this stock rom so if the device integrity is going to pass that means the device is certified so simply you are good to go to use a lot of applications except those application which check the strong integrity now talking about third situation which is very worst situation yeah guys simply install this application i will provide the link on description this application name is momo application okay simply download this application install it and open it and suppose in your device it shows t is broken as we can see i attach the screenshot if in your case the t is broken that means you are not able to pass any type of integrity you are not able to pass strong integrity basic integrity device integrity none of the integrity you are not able to pass it okay so this that's why i said this is very worst situation so you need to repair this t so it is very lengthy process and if you do comment on this video i will plan one video on this topic to repair how to repair t okay so this is a video if you like this video then please like and share this video see you in the next video love you guys goodbye take care